Hello, collective. Hang on, I'll get us a story out here. I hope y'all doing well today, collective. I appreciate you guys. Um, I got two decks here. I always do, though. Y'all know that. That's how I love. I do want this stuff. I heard you guys. Now, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I welcome you to Pam Star Oracle. I'm Pam. I um, hope to give you something today that will help you along your journey and my journey. And ooh, what uh oh. Ooh, is that what it is? Hang on, you guys. I think I need it to put it all out like this. Oh, is that what it is? Oh, da -da. is that what it is? Okay. Oh, here it is, Collective. I love you guys. I love you guys. Sorry, I was having to tune into my reading. I didn't want to be too focused on blabbering and not getting the story out the right way. Uh, the right way of the first time. Okie dokie, pokey pokies. Okay, so what it's saying is, uh, our element come out, and this is about communication, you know, communicating. Uh, someone's thinking of communicating their love. Do you love spirit? 226. Ain't it something? It says, softly, softly, the tender touch. Oh, so you know what it's saying? It says somebody loves the way that you communicate. They could just listen to you talk over and over till the morning hours. Oh, that's what it said. Oh, wow. Let's see what else they want to say. They want to say, oh, they had faith in this process the whole time. And it's telling somebody you're free from judgment and free to love this person. Because beyond the mind, the heart beats. Oh, gosh. Y'all's minds is on each other. And you all can telepathically talk to each other. You see how... It looks like she's, yeah, you, you're, it's telling you right now to, because you had faith in this process, spirit is blessing you at the moment. Um, maybe you got a lot of light bulb moments about this love and how it feels and, uh, it's just, you're noticing all the synchronicities, you know, and. Spirit said they're 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 proud of you for having faith this whole time and not veering off this path. For not veering off the path. They love you and they appreciate you. Do you like how I put my cards like that? Yeah, yeah. And please don't steal that idea. Thank you. Uh, because I like doing it. And and I know the ones to put together I noticed. Oh wow. You trusted yourself. Oh, looky there. I love this and, and I do trust myself. This is an Aquarian deck. I'm an Aquarian. That's why I use it. Oh, this is the power of attraction. Ooh, Pandora's gift. See, you got Pandora's gift. Oh, gosh. The gift is the way that you communicate your love to the world around. That's what it is. This helps with attracting what's meant for you in your life. Look, spiritual union. Oh, God, you're all just like balls of magnets. Oh, gosh. Divine Master said, oh, God. He loves that you got balls like a guy and you just stand up to everybody and you stand up for what you want, God. It it turns him on. Oh, God. And I know that's true, you all. 444. Four, four. Oh, God, my divine master, he wants to tar me up now all the time. Oh, God, he does. And he says, oh, God, you're like Black Moon Lilith. They're a damn mystery. And we can't figure you out. Oh, but I love you. And I love that quality about you. You might have big old birth and hips. See how big it helps? I got, I got like that. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, I got like a little bit of old sag tits, but it's okay. It's okay, you guys. I don't care. I'm not, I never been one to uh, think about, you know, that plastic surgery and shit. Ooh, Mars Force. Ooh, the mystery is coming out with force. I think, look, it says, I think being forceful is the mystery. The mystery is forcing you to think. Oh, I love you, spirit. See how spirit told? See? See? I'm telling you. The, it, uh, so the energy right now is just telling you to think before you leap. But it says to trust yourself because you had faith this whole time. Huh? This is visions of life beyond death. You know, uh, you're like this owl. Uh, you got a lot of wisdom, you know. The divines helped you. You got a lot of peacock down energy in you. You're so bright and bold and you know, you're just fearless and courageous and dang almighty. You're so creative and that's why Leo come out right here. So, and, uh, you know, create it. Leo is creativity and that paternal energy and courageous. And so you've had visions of this creative uh, life that you was going to lead. Oh, I feel it. <laughs> It says, I feel that this creativity is, is, a uh, is, a uh, bringing visions of life beyond death. Yeah, it's like you, you saw through that you was going to be a success. Oh, you're receiving, ooh, you're opening your, um, you, you're open to giving and receiving, and you're receiving the call. 707, 707, you're receiving the call, ooh, and... This is you're receiving a spiritual union, and that's the truth. Look, you're receiving a spiritual union, and that's the truth. You believed it this whole time. I love this story. Do you love this story as much as me, Collective? Well, y'all better hit subscribe and like. You better hit like if you're on my channel all the time looking, please. That's the only way y'all get. A, I can get around. When it does good readings, you need to do that for me so they get around, all right? There's a lot of my readings that are good, and they don't get around. That's why I need your all's help. When you give me a lot of likes, it'll get around in the community, and I thank you all. So I can give that damn prize away. Let's get to over 500. Come on. I love you guys. Because that's a good one. So I'll, if you keep on communicating this love softly the way you're doing, and keep that faith, and, and you know, and trust yourself that this that's the mystery is this power of attraction your all's heart beats as one the gift is you thinking and feeling your truth that this is you're going to receive this spiritual union oh wow and you're going to be a creative success and i don't i don't know that for me and i'm telling you guys that okay so let me put these up and do another something all right you guys Put these up, you guys. Where did I put them, you guys? They freaking disappeared right before my eyes. I don't know where I put them, y'all. Oh, but I guess they're under these little cars. I don't know. Yeah, there they are. Okay. They're under the little cars. Hell, I don't know. That must be where they are, yo, yo. You got the key to this big old white stag's heart, baby. That's what it said, baby. That's what it said. They said you got the heart. Uh-huh. Spirit, I can't have seven. Let's do it again. Give us one for the collective. Oh, wow, wowdy, woody. They give us three. Titiana, Titiana, uh, somebody got some fake tits. If you got fake tits, hit subscribe and like. I get some good stories over here, love stories. Ooh, yeah. I get some good love stories, and that's how I'm going to get around. Ooh, Titiana, a fake queen offers a trade. If you sacrifice something extraordinarily precious to you, you may look at the top three cards 
uh, the deck and choose a card to draw. So I, it's just saying, if you sacrifice something that you really enjoy, uh, it's precious to you, you can choose. You get your choice, I guess. I don't know. I don't really get that card, but it says Merkin Wolves. I guess I meant like American Wolves, like you're a Mer Merkin Merkian wolves. It says your party is hunted by 16 wolves and you encounter a hostile dragon. So there's a dragon trying to burn you down and 16 wolves is fought. The, there's 16 people following you around. Look. Trying to burn you. Beautiful spiritual person. That's like a guardian angel. Oh, did you hear that? And they're going to burn you to the ground because they don't like that. I don't know. And, and, and they these these people might have sacrificed you, okay? They was trying to sacrifice something precious to of yours, them motherfuckers. Did you hear that, 1119? I hate those sons of bitches, whoever they are. I really do. I hate them. I don't know who it is, but I don't like them trying to sacrifice something, something, man. It better not be what I think it is. Some of this shit pisses me off. Ding! Change energy. Ding, 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 ding. Spirit, give us a good reading. Give us a good love message, please. Spirit, give us something good for the collective now. It says there's a lot of things that God will show you that you ain't supposed to tell others of because he chose you. He chose you how he to show you how it works and that's true a lot of people can't handle things that and god knows that you, you uh universe raw you know it you know that because a lot of people can't handle it you know that yourself you're going through a transformation at the moment because you might have been going through a battle of head versus heart you was choosing your head over your heart and maybe uh, uh, what it's saying is God universe was trying to teach you of this battle that you was going through. And it says it's purely disrespective of whoever this person was to neglect you and your feelings. And, and you was feeling depleted of energy and things because you, di you didn't know if you could trust them. Or if they even really cared about you because they didn't tell you. They left you up in your head. You know? What's that? That's what is that? Narcissist? They just want you to build up their ego. Oh, and you're a mystery, and uh, they don't know how you escaped all their traps they set for you, huh? They don't know how you escaped them all. Maybe they're trying to lead you out to a tent in the woods or something. I don't freaking know. I don't know you all. I draw that on that card. <laughs> I don't know why it didn't really go with the story, but hell, I don't know why. What else? <laughs> Oh, and uh, somebody was taking their anger out on you, and, and you wasn't even the one. Like, you tried to help this person, and they was mad at They was mad at you. They're mad at you because you didn't fall for their bullshit and their trap. They're mad. 1344. We don't give a freak. <laughs> you get mad. The person that your job was taking money out of, somebody at your job might have been taking money from the register and and uh, telling you was stealing or something. Or acting like, tell, saying to you, like, they ain't no money, blah, blah, trying to make you feel bad. You know what I mean? And you didn't even, never even probably be at the cash register. You know, 14, 14, 55, and you changed and you quit working or maybe like that. Sounds like it, because I don't like it, bullshit. Some of us have nothing to worry about. We didn't do nothing, and God loves you for that. That's why it landed under it, and somebody needs to forgive their uh, mother and father for all the things that they've done to you over the years so you can heal these old issues. So you need to forgive your mothers and fathers out here so you can heal them issues, you know. You can forgive them, but you don't have to forget, you know what I'm saying. But if you bring it up all the time, you're never going to, uh, forget it, I guess. And somebody needs to focus on becoming a better human being and learn how to show up in the world. But you, you, this person, 
This person that was making you feel depleted of energy because they was wanting to keep you in your head and not in your heart. Whoever wanted to keep you like that. Now they're learning uh, to become a better human from you. Somebody that tried to set a trap for you. Who was that spirit setting trap? Who was setting a trap? Do I need new cards? Who was setting a trap? They was trying to set a trap for you, person that's healed on the inside. You got a peaceful demeanor. And they're mad because your, your smart mind, and your intellectual mind uh, ain't around anymore. They're, they're mad at you. People get mad at you because you're smart. They're, you're smart? Well, you, good. Who wants to get lured off and killed? 1555 in a 10 or whatever the hell it is, you know? That's trying to lure you, Summers. And maybe this was a man, uh, whoever this person was taking money and lying or whatever, y'all might work at a gym. I don't know. That must be somewhere big if it is. Like a lot of people go or I don't know. What else on our God is good? What what you feel, you speak on it. And you know how to make people see two sides of the story. And God loves you for that. And people love you for that. And people hate you for that too. And, uh... <laughs> oh, and, uh... Somebody needs to forgive their mom and daddy of all the bullshit they done. And about to battle a head versus heart. And it says... Hey, sexy, shut the door. Drop your pants. Climb on top of me and satisfy your needs. Love always your toilet. <laughs> oh. Somebody says that you sound like shit. That's why I wrote that. <laughs> or you said this is a bunch of bullshit. You said flush it down a commode. No more bullshit. <laughs> I don't know. That's funny. I just, I don't know. It didn't land out, but it said it. So he says, F them all. What you feel, you speak on it. You know how to show two sides of the story. You're funny as hell. You're like, listen to my little toilet joke. <laughs> and, put, and you said, well, fuck these people if they can't focus on becoming a better human and learning that, you know, in order to trust, you have to talk to that person. You can't just be in your head all the time and not tell your emotions because you end up hurting yourself, you know. It could even kill you, like, with stress. Um... No, I, I won't get rid of this card. I won't get rid of this card. I don't like it no more. What else, spirit? What else, spirit? This person is going through withdrawals. If they don't have their fix, they take out their emotions on you and it starts a fight and you need to leave people like this before they take you down with them. Oh, them people that was setting traps for you, it was your dope friends, and you said, fuck them, I don't want to be like that, I don't like drugs, leave me alone, i got a smart mind, and then you're all mad because I'm smart and I don't want to do that anymore, well, fuck you all, why would y'all try to take my income from me, well, God is going to come to the rescue for his spiritual partner, he will bless you with money, so don't worry, my child, because you start working for yourself, you know, you start working for yourself. And you find that God inside of you. That's all it means. Oh, 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 they scared. They lost you. It's a man that likes to stare at you if you're doing workouts, whoever his story's for. I don't know. And somebody's staring at this high honor woman that might be stealing money from the higher ups, and they're scared. They, they, uh, because you told on them. Look, and they fold around a lot. See, I don't know. That didn't sound too good. Let me get another story. Elf, all these people, that's jealous and whatever. And forgive people and don't forget. Choose to be positive and happy and not mad. That's what it's saying because that's the wrong way. Choosing mad is the wrong way. I love spirits see mad at the bottom and wrong at the bottom. I love my spirit guys. They're funny, cunny, funny. <laughs> Funny, funny bunches of oats. That's why we call them the best of the bunch. Ooh, maybe somebody says you are the honey bunches of oats. And please watch your step because you might be stepping into some shit that you wish you'd never stepped in now. 
And it says foot and eyes. <laughs> yeah, I should have drawn a man stepping in a pile of shit instead of foot and eyes, but I just thought it was funny. It was like somebody needed to kick somebody. <laughs> oh, friend zoned somebody. Friend zone. You friend zoned somebody and they got mad at you and went around and lied at you on the on you to people at around in the community. Or your friend group, or they went around a lot to family, and it got all around the community and made you quit your jobs and push you into a spiritual practice like it did me. Maybe. I don't know. And maybe this person loves fo football, whoever this is, or they play football, or they used to play college football. Oh, and they sent dark energy from some dark spiritualists in the tarot community. Maybe uh, somebody that likes taking from you and my, me and my collective like football and shit like that they're doing it that person oh 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 and they're being nosy and some people need to stop poking in their nose into others relationships and learn to tend to their life and leave yours alone you know that's when i wait that's what i say to these friends that's why they got mad and then they tried to fuck up our relationships and look and your angels will guide you uh, away from people like that, and they will guide you to the person that's meant for you, the one who will be true to you. See? Oh, who do they lead to, baby? Which was a spiritual practice to an earth angel, a star seed, because you have a greater purpose, honey. That is why do you see? I love my spirit guides. See, because some of y'all probably be like, that story, she rigged it. But do you see, I don't. It always comes out the uh, good damn way. 2144, I love you, spirit guys. I'm grateful for you. Oh, I'm grateful for you. And they're mad, these people. Oh, and uh, you got uh, supernatural forces that push and pull divine masculine to divine feminine with sudden revelations of days of old. With dreams, uh, with drums of beating, I see you, divine feminine, and war together, having a meeting, loving and kissing, with our greeting. Oh, did you love my poem, my poem? Ooh. It says, supernatural forces push and pull divine masculine to divine feminine with sudden revelations of days of old. With drums of beating, I see you, divine feminine, and we're together having a meeting, loving and kissing with our first greeting. Oh, God, y'all love each other so big. Ooh, maybe there's a football game on it. Y'all's first greeting, 2244. That's what it was. That's what it was. Oh, wow. And they said, I never seen somebody as natural and unique and beautiful as you are on your own. I love you. I la 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 love you. My earth seed angel star seed love. It says your beauty is stunning. One look from you makes my heart beat as fast as a hummingbird's a wings of fluttering. I love you, lovely lady. They love that you out poems and say things like that. They have it. What about dark energy? Shit from the tarot community. Dark. Remember, tarot people that's doing this. You all can't blame me for all y'all's dirty ways and dirty tricks, nor can you uh, poison people with slandering anymore. Learn to stay to, we learn to stay to ourselves, and it's killing them slowly. It's killing them slowly because you ain't paying no mind to nobody but your practice. Uh. And it says, people that pokes their nose into our relationship try to take me and Divine Feminine down. This is Divine Masculine saying it. And you'll see what happens to you and your family. You'll get cuffed, babe. Oh, wow. That's true. It's so true. What about? What about it? Oh, wow. And if you look, it said the angels is guiding you, star seed or earth angel, uh, for you to be very unique on your own and speak of these supernatural forces that helps the collective uh, did you see what it said 2424 oh wow and remember i remember that time remember i remember remember on south park it's funny <laughs> uh, so uh so your earth angel starcy love their remembering their remembering your alls that's why that poem i wrote right there 2444 come out 
And uh, this man needs to come clean, clean to you and be honest. They need to be honest with anything that they've done. And uh, this person might have been sleeping around on you and you felt it when you was making love and it threw jokes through your heart. Did you hear that? That's what, that's the truth. It is getting ready to come out. That's the truth. That somebody fucked in your relationship. And uh, they lie to you. And when the planets are conjunct, they actually work together to influence certain areas of your life. This is where influential and you can collaborate. Oh, yeah. Conjunction is working for you, baby. For you to be powerful in these people in the spiritual community seeing the dark energy. They can't blame me for nothing. That's what it's saying because they poke their nose into my story. Did you see that? Oh, I love that spirit. Spirit, do you all love it? Collective, I love you guys. I don't talk about my good collective that don't do that. No, no. We're talking about people that all they do is thieve. And that's how they've become famous is doing that. Did you listen to what in the hell I said? That's what we're talking about, okay? Oh, I love you, sp 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 spirit. Okay, another poem by Pamela. Nobody can copy what my poems say because that's how I'm going to make my way. <laughs> hey? And I'm going to sell them to my collective and they're going to say, I love you, Pam Star Oracle. That's what they're going to say. 2626, 26, I know it, 88, I know it, I know it. 88, so I'm going to be abundant from it too, me and, me and my collective, because I'll get back. Oh, it says the way you shake that ass should be a crime. No one has ever had an ass that's so damn fine. Oh, did you love my poem? That was mine. Pound Star Oracle. So it says the way you shake that ass should be a crime. No one has ever had an ass that's so damn fine. Ooh, Pound Star Oracle, you love that? You're going to get cut for trying to get Pound Star Oracle and her old man. Because you're not going to do that. You need to tend to your own life and leave mine alone. <laughs> and my collectors, you need to leave ours alone. Leave our shit alone because you're getting ready to get a foot in your eyes. You wish you hadn't stepped into this shit. <laughs> Protect yourself with priors because people want what you have built. No, motherfucker, you don't take what I built. No. No, I'll burn it all to the ground. Do you see what that said? That's what that means. Uh, and give any issues that you have over to God and to the divine, and they will take care of them, and they'll show you with synchronicities that they're taking care of you. Yeah, see, I, I understand them numbers. I know what they mean. Okay, and nobody's taking them. No, nobody's taking them. Because my idea was to uh, work for them, uh, Sun Signs or somebody, so I could do all them numbers, and nobody's going to fucking steal that, because I will one day. So try to steal it, and it will be taken down as soon as I see it. Oh, and these people want everybody that you want. They're not happy until they, f they uh, have every person that you like, or fuck everybody you do, but you feel their energy, and you know what these kind of people are. It's all about humping. They like to get on your leg and dry hump you like a down dog. <laughs> they like to dry hump you 28, 28. Oh, yeah, that's what it is, ain't it? Dry humpers. Member, I member that this person better start being honest, man or woman, about who they been sleeping around with. Now, the planet's in conjuncts is helping you to be a collaborative a creative and influential, powerful person, and the way you shake that ass should be a damn crime. No one has ever had an ass that's so damn fine. Oh, God. And uh, everybody wants you. Oh, God. And they ain't happy till they get you now. And these people's nosy in the spiritual community, some of them, that send in this dark spiritual this dark energy, yep, some of them are, and they love to copy everything you say. You starseed, earth angel, oh, and the angels tell on them every time they show you who it is, so you can tell on them and say, boo, thumbs down. <laughs> 29, 29, 11, 11, twin flame, I love you, see? Please watch the signs. I'm a true from the divine. <laughs> oh, wow. And it says, when our friends on you, you got pissed. Oh, well. 
supernatural forces is pulling divine masculine to divine feminine with sudden revelations of the old days they spent with you. Oh, God, you're so unique. They never saw something so pretty. Look at all our flowers. They love your loveliness. Oh, God. And they, they said these people, they can't blame you for everything. They got to go to jail. That's why you're seeing all these numbers. One on one, two, 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 because they, because they took a business that you built. Oh, wow. They're trying to take the business you built. And Spirit said, hey, 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 hell, fuck no. That's what Spirit said. So don't get mad, you guys. That's just what Spirit says. That's just what Spirit said that they're trying to do, okay? And uh, that's why Pallas, that Pallas came out. And this is named for the Roman goddess Pallas, this asteroid. Also referred to as Pallas Athena. Represents wisdom, creative, creative intelligence, and reason. When she appears in your chart, you can help you understand how you seek knowledge and solve problems. Pallas is also associated with warfare and can indicate where you take matters into your own hands, creating a plan of action around major life-changing opportunities. So during these retrograde phases, you need there's a there's a life-changing opportunity, and it's been feeling uh, energy of slow and. Um, it was trying to make you redo something. It could have been uh, how you communicate, but your difficulties is over. I love you, spirit. I didn't. My throat's sore. I can't read all at you all, but I know what it means. And I love you guys. And thirty-one, thirty-one, and Jupiter. It represents, uh, you know, look and learning and growth, and uh, and you know, never. This is never one to stay put in the same place for long. Jupiter moves around seeking knowledge in order to cultivate an understanding of life. It's also associated with gambling and may act on a whim to place a bet and then win big as a result of its lucky ability to gain success swiftly. Jupiter changes zodiac signs every year and a half. So, um, so when, if, so, uh, if you see at Pallas Athena in your chart, it's trying to help you see where you can solve this problem that might be a Sagittarius, okay? It, it, that you have with a Sagittarius. And um, these retrograde phases also have a positive effect because they are time to complete unfinished business and connect to people from your past. So, maybe... Uh, but like it was saying earlier, I think uh, this life-changing opportunity is, it was feeling slow, but you had to redo the way you communicated when Mercury was in retrograde. And now when uh, Jupiter, when it starts going backwards, it might are, it already is right now, I think. That's where luck is and success is swiftly coming. Oh, I love it. Do y'all love it? Spirit loves it too. Ooh, ooh. And somebody lo uh, loves you guys, gals out here. I know they do. I know they do. Oh, and let me see what I see for you guys. Oh, wow. 11. 11 yin yang. This number is important for twin flames. It symbolizes the harmony and balance of soul counterparts, yin and yang, like the yin yang symbol. Twin flames contain an aspect of each other's character within themselves. Oh, and I just seen it a while ago in 3333 where we know how to manifest. The Sin of Masters is helping us and they love us. Oh, and all these signs that we're getting is saying your twin flame, if, if you're not with them, they're really close to coming towards you at the moment. They wish for you. They wish for this the same as you. You're all twins. You're all twins and you're fucking powerful. You're very magnetic. Like a magnet drawing each other. Zzz, I love you. Oh, be receptive to this. That's what it's saying. All right. Well, I love you, collective. Hit subscribe if you knew and watched all the way through pieces. Thank you. And hit all. And you can see me every time I upload pieces. I love you, collective.